Okay, guys, so at the end of the last episode, I crashed, which is why it ended so abruptly. This is episode 5 of Into the Depths, and I'm hoping that we don't crash this time, although we're probably dead. Oh, it spawned us back in here, because the crash was kind enough to do that for us, so thank you so very much. You're obviously so kind and considerate. So to make sure I don't crash, I'm going to turn my graphics and my smooth lighting off to see if that helps. Okay, slowly. Okay. There we go. It's just audio for my computer. I think it's because I haven't got enough RAM set to my Minecraft. But audio tends to be a bit iffy with my computer. So I'm not even going to wait. I'm just going to run. Because this is lagging. And I'm concerned. Okay, pause, 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 pause. This is really badly lagging. Like, this is pain. Oh, okay, so it's just my smooth lighting was causing me to lag more than I should have. Okay. Oh, God. There's a chest over there that I think I'd like to get. Uh, this should come in handy. Low on food. It's in bad shape. Go, 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 go. Get the hell away from me. Oh, there's probably spawners and crap in here, ain't there? Is this the hospital wing? Is this all? Oh, no. Gabriella Reina hospital wing. I need to find a keyhole to it. Brilliant. And that's probably hidden in that path that I passed like an hour ago. Okay, let's light this area up anyway. Okay, so... This part of the map is very laggy for me. I'm, I'm, I think it may just be the audio, but I've got a 16 gigabytes of RAM on my computer and it's a quad processor. So if it's lagging, I don't mean to be rude, but I don't want to blame. Oh, this seems safe. This seems so safe. Can I hit you? Nope. I can pretend I can. Alright, lock the door. God damn, that was uncomfortable, to say the least. I didn't expect audio cues to just kill my game so badly. Another fireplace is still burning. How long has it been since it was lit? I like I'm just exploring these people's houses, just kind of, yeah. Bo! Oh, you are fabulous. Oh, you are the most fabulous thing I have seen in a long time. Also, I do not need you in the, the, okay, I'll put the splash potion there. Okay, okay. Lumberjack Diary. I'll never have to work another day in my life. The king has come to me with the request that I make sure no one enters or leaves the hospital wing, and in return he gave me that strange ore that when set on fire never goes out. My days of chopping wood are long behind me. I can finally let those old bones get a good rest. Good for you. Uh, I obviously... Nether rack is... That was random. So th th this, this is of no importance then, yeah? This is of no importance at all. So what was the point of coming here other than for some exposition? I mean, I understand he's the one that's meant to stop us from getting into the wing, and we probably just murdered him. Is there anything, like, around his house that we can take, or do I... Okay, guys, so... I am an idiot. There was a reason we got flint and steel, and that was because we can burn wool with the flint and steel. Now, I only knew this because... In the map download for the latest version, it came with a walkthrough in case you got hopelessly lost. I didn't even know you could use the wall to do that. And that was what the flint and steel was. I was so confused. And now it all suddenly makes sense. And I'm so glad that it does. Holy hell, that was... That was a nightmare. I'm hoping I sped up. The, I'm, I've sped up the, the beginning footage mostly, or, or jump cut it, I hope, because 
that was literally seven to eight minutes of a mess of me just going across without thinking. And that was what the flint and steel in that other place was for. Uh, with all the mobs, uh, there was that wall that I thought was made of clay. It was actually made of wool. And yes, I am lagging right now, but it will calm down once we get inside. So, oh my god. Why am I lagging so much? Somebody helps me, please. Okay. And now I'm putting all my smooth lighting and stuff back because I cannot live without my smooth lighting. That was a hilarious mess. Now we've got another store here, and I have 12 uh, bars, so what can we do, what can we do, what can, what can we do, I'm not sure, um, cooked chicken is 7 gold, so I'll probably get that, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, I wonder if I can just rob the store if people will be upset or not. How much do the champions diamond 65 gold? Yeah, bullcrap. That's never happening unless you save up the entire level until here. Also, from looking at the walkthrough, this is area 2 of like 4 or 5. We just got through the first act. As far as I'm aware. Take that for what you will, guys. Just take that for what you will. I'd like to inform everyone that the king has ordered the closure of the hospital wing. I am not at liberty to discuss the reason, and there is currently no word as to when it will be open again. I urge everyone within the castle to be careful and try not to injure themselves in any way, because you will not be treated. I apologize for the inconvenience, and will continue to update you as all things progress. Gabriella Reina, head nurse. Oh, that bitch. <laughs> uh, note to self, I'll get rid of that. Uh, the executioner, get rid of that. Alright, let's continue into this creepy looking hospital. Oh, I think we're finally getting into the really creepy stuff and block glitches. Because block glitches are so much fun. Alright, what's all this say? Right, let's, let's actually put some torches up. Place TNT here, to cemetery. This wall looks fragile. Maybe I can find a way to take it down. Why cement the door to the cemetery? I don't know. To medical wing. Well, this is awkward. I can use this to ignite the dynamite. Ah, so we've got more flint and steel. With the tools here, I should be able to put together some explosives to take out that wall that leads to the cemetery. Now I just need to find the materials. Gunpowder and some sand should do. Okay, so that's where we make... So we're going to go around and we're going to blow up the, the hospital wing. We're going to hack the planet with explosives. Gabriella Reina. Gabriella? Gabriella, darling, where are you? Let's see what she really thinks. Does she really support freaking Shkunda or whatever his name was? The king hasn't been himself lately. With the strange behavior, the murders, he isn't the same man we once served. And now he closes the hospital wing? I don't know what his plan is, but he has always done what he had to do. He always made the hard choices, and that's what makes him a great leader. He's being secretive, but we'll find out what he's up to eventually. I have to retain my trust in him. And I have to. And I can hear a freaking spider. I heard you. Watch out. I'm going to go in the other one first because it seems kind of safe. Oh, crap. I was expecting like a giant monster to be behind there. Or some kind of creepy thing to happen. What's that? Patient 885. Patient 885 is the first of six to begin showing some kinds of new disease. He was the first to be murdered by the king. Only none of their deaths were instant. East patients suffered a stab wound directly through the heart and somehow were all able to live anywhere from 18 to now 34 hours, being the highest recorded. The patient then dies and within an hour begins suffering from grotesque mutations. Their flesh rots off at an alarming rate, and their faces become elongated, bringing them to a physical appearance that can only be described as pig-like. The patients then reanimate. They come back to life in front of our eyes. Strangely, they are somewhat intelligent and are not hostile unless provoked in any way, as demonstrated when one of the nurses attempt to sedate the creature with a needle. We're not sure what to make of this, 
It seems like some kind of viral outbreak, but the consistency and the manner in which the patients were killed raised some questions. Okay, so pretty much the king has gotten some kind of nether powers. His subjects have been turned into zombie pigmen through his magical powers, and he's pretty much screwing everyone over at this point. So, good on you, kingy. You fucked up. I'm breaking that literally because I don't like vines at all. Well, I wonder where the spiders are. Hmm, this place is massive, by the way. Heading out here, beautiful place. Uh, this will be useful if I need to fill something with water. Luckily, I kept that bucket earlier, because I didn't know whether it was a one-time use item. And some hos some supplies. Okay, so straight into the spider area then? Yep, yeah. okay. No, I, I can't. I, I don't care if you have to go in there. I can't. That's really... I need to psych myself up for that. Okay, let's see. What else can we do anyway? Okay, that's a bit weird. Anything down this way either? I mean, I'd hope so. Alright, sanitarium wards. Re requires a keyhole. Okay. Uh, and this requires... We're going to have to go in there, aren't we? We are going to have to go in there. This trail leads into the psych ward. I need to find a way inside. The psych evaluation room. Yep, these places are going to the nut house. What the... Okay, magma blocks. Newly admitted patients. Well, you seem okay. You're only a zombie pig man. You're kind of screwed up, but... There's something on the other side. Even more of them. I'm not sure if you're meant to be out here or not. Oh my. Patience note. I thought you were coming after me for a second. Alright, I'm gonna wait here and use the patience note because I want to see what they're saying. He comes here every night. He peeks his face through the window and stares at me for hours on end. Never saying a word, direct eye contact until the morning comes. I can't take much more of this. Crap. This is kind of dark. Uh oh. That's an actual enemy. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. This is fucked up. Oh, great. So I have to... Wait. I can break this. It's clay. Two potion room key. Alright, let's get the magma cubes. Because they're kind of deadly and dangerous. Actually, let's use Scuster's Blade, because I think that might be safer. Actually, I think I'm going to run out of uh, a sword soon, so I'm going to have to buy one at the store. Oh, this is just going to get... Um, this is going to become a mess. Okay. I know I... Oh, my Scuster's Blade ran out. Crap. Okay. Ow! Where did you come from? I'm fairly certain I made you all tiny. Maybe I didn't. Oh, there's so many flame jerrys. This is uncomfortable. Oh, God. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Oh, there's another decent-sized one. Okay. And you're dead. Okay, all of them are dead. Except for you. You snuck up on me. All right, let's light this area up. Also, I was uh, looking on the forums uh, when I was looking for a walkthrough because I had to re-download it. Because I downloaded the version literally just before the walkthrough was added. And pretty much, uh, some interesting things. To the potion room. Do I want to go in there? That is a question I need to have answered. Apparently, yes, I do. Torch, more melons. 
My Neanderthal's might's gonna run out. My stone sword isn't gonna last. This is not good. Oh, this is creepy as hell. This is actually one of the creepiest things I have seen in a while. Okay, so this entire place is so Silent Hill-esque. Man. I'm just getting all of the horror vibes from this. Alright, not sure what that means, but let's take a look at it. Putting you back away, because I don't need you. Watun die. We don't die, we don't die, we don't die, we don't die. Oh. Oh, the patients are conscious. Oh, no. I'm pretty sure that's what it means. The patients don't die, and they're aware of it. So, self-aware, crazy patients who don't die, who are being used by the king for unspeakable deeds. That's good, right? Looks like I made potions here. I just need to find some ingredients. Like, what kind of potions can I make here? It's, oh, fire. I'm gonna need that, I'm guessing. Start with water. He's until boiled. Add the wort to create something not so normal. The next ingredient comes from a creature found by traveling deep into the depths. The gel-like substance found at the core of its spiraling body. And finally, to make the effects everlasting, particles found closest to the surface. Those which light hell's lanterns, giving the potion its... Okay, so it's a fire resistance potion, pretty much, that we're making. We already have the magma cream, so that's a plus. Uh, supply closet, witch, do witch doctor. Lovely. I've received a letter from my sister this morning. Those bastards in Ort de Steel tore apart my house and found my spellbook. Hypocrites, all of them. They banished me for witchcraft, and now they want to go and use my own spells? She says someone was to decipher only a small portion of my notes and is now able to utilize my fire control spell. This is not good. That's interesting. Alright, I need to keep that. And the glass bottle, so... Let's go to the supply closet and we can get some more stuff. I think the supply closet was downstairs? Or was it over here? Ward's key. Oh. Oh. This is a key into the wards. Is that, that's not around here. That's... I'm pretty sure that's... In the, the normal world. In, like, the... The normal place. Like, when you go back outside. Oh. Oh. I think I see how it's gonna work. This is... To, this map is just getting creepier and creepier, and I love it. Oh, uh, for a second, I thought you were gonna hurt me, you bastard. <laughs> oh my god, that was terrifying. I honestly thought for a moment it was gonna kill me. So, bravo, brava, bravissima. <laughs> love saying that. Uh, that's the psych key. I think this is the wards down here. Is this the wards? San wards key, yeah, the sanitarium wards. Oh man. Okay. Lots of interesting stuff there. I'm running out of torches. Okay, kill you. I'm a ah, you bugger. No. I will not let you be the winner of this game. Fight, fight, fight. I don't know. Alright, so this is the wards. I'm going to try not to use as many torches because I'm running out. Room 106. Oh, hi. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Die, die, die. This, this gives me a really big Silent Hill 2 feel. Patient in room 106 is suspected of using narcotics. Tests are scheduled this afternoon to confirm speculation. Although no physical evidence of drugs were found, patient shows signs of altered thinking. Okay, so patient 106 has gone insane. Okay. Either that or he's being brainwashed. Either way, poor him. Medicine room. Maybe this will contain some of the stuff we need for the... Oh. The medicine cabinet's locked, so that's, uh... Fudge. Fudge nutters. Okay, this is to cook. Let's cook the raw beef, please. Uh, what do we not need? We don't need that clay, so... Just chuck that in there. Chuck the string in there. 
This we need to keep. Alright. Steak. Lovely. I like steak. Steak gives you a lot of saturation, and as such, it's one of the most useful foods in the world. I'm really going to need to go back to the store and buy a new sword in a minute. Because if I run out, I'm... Oh, thank God there's a store here. Oh, thank God. Okay. Oh, good. You can just die. Okay. And dead. Alright, how much for a sword? Stone sword, 12. Iron sword, 24. You know what? I'm getting that iron sword. 1, 2, 3, 4. Thank you. And is there anything else I can buy? I can buy a potion. Splash harm potion for 4. Slow potion for 3. Torches. Uh, I'll buy 4 torches. If I do get desperate, I'm just going to rob the thing. But I hope it does not come to that. Honestly, I really hope it doesn't. Okay. So, we've made it to another store. And as such, I think this is a very good place to end the episode. I'm not sure if I've, I've gone too long that I'm going to have to split this episode up. But I hope you've enjoyed it so far. We're in the hospital wing now. And there's a lot more to this place than meets the eye. So hopefully we'll be able to kill some more mobs. Get through this place. And see if we can discover the issues going on with Shkusta and his kingly rule. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Into the Depths. Feel free to like, rate, comment, and subscribe if you are enjoying the series. Of course, leave a nice kind of bit of feedback down below. It always helps me out. And I will see you next time, guys. Goodbye.